Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 edition. Page 440. Pupillary Light Reflex. Please follow the picture of pupillary light reflex to answer the following questions. Describe the pupillary light reflex. When you shine the light in either of the eye, the light hits the retina and a signal is sent via cranial nerve 2. And cranial nerve 2 is the optic nerve. So as you can see here in the picture, that there is a signal being sent through the cranial nerve 2 and that signal is going to get to the pretectal nuclei, which is located in the midbrain and that will activate bilaterally the ettinger westphal nuclei. So both of the ettinger westphal nuclei are going to get activated even if you just shine the light in one eye. And since we have already talked about the ettinger westphal nucleus, we know that when ettinger westphal nuclei are activated, they will cause pupillary constrictions bilaterally. So this is the consensual reflex, which means that even if you shine the light in only one eye, it will result in bilateral pupillary constriction. What is Marcus Gunn pupil and why does it happen? Marcus Gunn pupil is afferent pupillary defect and it happens due to optic nerve damage or retinal detachment. Describe the clinical presentation of Marcus Gunn pupil. The clinical presentation of this would be decreased bilateral pupillary constriction when the light is shown in the affected eye relative to the unaffected eye. What test is used to diagnose Marcus Gunn pupil? The test used to diagnose Marcus Gunn pupil is the swinging flashlight test. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.